Hi there, St. Martin's community. This is Kale Moffat, one of the librarians, and I had a very good question come up this week, and I thought I would do a quick video to answer it. And the question is, how do you use Google Scholar to find literature reviews? So, let's go see. All right, here we are at Google Scholar. Now let's pretend that I'm writing a paper on fetal alcohol syndrome. So let's go ahead and enter that. I've already done that, so here it is. Um, we have two search terms here, fetal alcohol syndrome and literature review. Now I've put the AND in capital letters here for a very specific reason. With it all in capital letters, it tells the computer this is not a search term, uh, but uh, that I have it's separating two search terms and that I want all sources that have both of those terms in them. Let's go ahead and execute the search here. Whoa, and we come up with 60,000 hits. That's way too many to um, for us to really process. Now we could filter by time, but that's kind of hit and miss. There's another way we can filter. Let's And to get to that, let's go ahead and click this Advanced School Google Scholar search. What we can do is we can take the and literature review out of this, of the all words, and let's put literature review Uh, if we spell it correctly, oh, there we go, in the exact phrase bar. Let's go ahead and execute that search. And we've reduced it considerably, but the bad news is it's still 18,000 hits, to far too much to get rid of. Now, the reason why that's happening is the computer is looking for fetal alcohol syndrome and literature review. Let's come back here and show you what I mean. The problem is it's looking anywhere in the article. So it can be in the abstract, it can be in um, paragraphs in the article. Let's go ahead and filter it even more. Let's go ahead and tell it to search only in the title of the article. And doing that, we get eight results, far more manageable. Uh, so we can do these this kind of search and we can filter in that way to get to, to the results we need. Let me take a moment here to uh, highlight an important research strategy and that is looking at synonyms. Um, let's look at literature review. Literature review is the most popular term for this concept but there are other terms that are used. Uh, probably the one of the most commonly used synonym is review of research. Now a review of research and literature review are they're very, that's basically the same concept here. But there are two other terms that you might encounter that are slightly different but related and those terms are systematic review and meta-analysis. The Oxford English Dictionary gives this definition for this kind of analysis. Analysis of data from a number of independent studies of the same subject published or unpublished, especially in order to determine overall trends and significance. Now the big difference between these analyses, these types of analyses, and a standard literature review is that uh, meta-analyses and systematic reviews try to come at specific conclusions that we can reach from looking at a wide range of, of the literature. Related idea, but not exactly the same. But looking for this kind of analysis can be really helpful in understanding and getting a good, rich understanding and knowledge of your um, of your topic. Hope this helps. Um, if you need help with your research or are stuck or just want somebody to bounce ideas off of, please come in and see us in the library. We are more than happy to help out however we can. Thanks so much. Bye.